Welcome back, guys. Hey, it's Team Fat Kid Memorial Day Monday. Memorial Day Monday. All right. So TFK, TFK MM? TFK MM? Not too much. No, Team Fat Kid Memorial Day Monday mm -hmm. it is. Mm -hmm. All right. <laughs> <laughs> so the Soft Fairy stopped by. Um, so we decided that we were going to... Sauce and Spice Day. Yeah. I have some cool things um, that they don't know about yet. We do have... <laughs> Quite a few sauces going Quite on. Quite a few. Um, different varieties. Uh, mm -hmm. Just so we're going to do little variations of different sauces and see what we personally like and how you can like it too. And we're going to try each sauce with a little bit of beef, meat, a and uh, what, pork, pork, beef, and chicken. Pork, beef, and chicken day. Yep. Why not? Um, but we were trying to figure out, because you know like we like wrapping things in bacon. We love wrapping things. We don't like bacon. <laughs> so, bacon's on sale. Um, it was actually buy two, get three free, so. Who's gonna turn that down? So we got five pounds <laughs> of bacon. <laughs> All right, so we got these pork chops, and I wanna attempt, like we've done the bacon wrap pork loin. The have. bacon wrap pork loin. So this time, I wanna stuff a pork chop and then bacon wrap that, and then deep fry it. Nothing, no, nothing about that. I, no, yeah. just pork, bacon wrap pork bombs. Basically. Sounds, right. sounds good to me. And we went with the chicken thighs. I prefer, uh, personally, I personally like chicken thighs over the breast. That's personal preference. Um, we grabbed a pound of, and I did take a shortcut on this. Um, ground beef. We, we got some ground beef and we're going to attempt something else that we're gonna deep fry. Do you, do you, do you wanna reveal that one or should we just let them sit in suspense with what's sitting here? Because I feel like that, that's pretty much what we're gonna use. You it can, looks like we're making spaghetti. You can start guessing if you'd like. Uh, okay. And of course we got some steak as well. Um, of course, because we like steak. I forgot to bring this over here because this is one of my surprises. So my mother-in-law went to Scotland and picked up a little something something. This is what is it? Scottish mixed smoky smoke? scotch whiskey seasoning salt. Right? Spice day. I mean, we're opening this today, right? Yeah. I saved it. What is it? What is it? Oh. <laughs> ooh. Oh, right? Ooh. Right? Only a ooh. Yeah, <laughs> get, get a ooh. Like, I don't, I don't know what I expected, but that's... That, that, that is a ooh. That's <laughs> nice. That's going to go on some steak. So... <laughs> so then, <laughs> you guys don't know about this. Haggis. <clears throat> <laughs> and the best part, it's in a can. Mm -mm. It's the only way my mother-in-law could get haggis through customs. <laughs> I was going to say, I've always wanted to try haggis, but I really don't know how I feel about it in a can. So I guess we'll find out. And then this... Is it pre-seasoned? I don't know. Because, I mean... Do you, it, do you even season brown? haggis? Like? <laughs> Technically, traditionally, I'm no. it's going to be a lot like uh, corned beef hash in a can. It's got oatmeal in it. Onion, salt, and spices. I mean, I mean it doesn't look like it's overly seasoned or anything. Uh, yeah, we'll look at that in a minute. I don't, I don't know how to feel about that yet. <laughs> I'm gonna eat it. <laughs> this is Team Fact Give Monday, Memorial Day Monday. Once again, thank you to all of our troops and those that didn't make it back. This is Team Fact Kid. Let's get the day started. Welcome back to Team Fact Kid Monday. Now it is. We're gonna stuff spaghetti meatball. Like what? What? what, what that's a spaghetti meatball stuffed with cheese. We're getting to that point. Yeah, all right. we'll figure out a name later. <laughs> all right. It's a. Yeah, no, no. Keep going. So we got, uh, this is a pork and beef blend. Usual suspects, salt, pepper, granulated garlic, granulated onion. Liberally. Liberally. Uh, little cracked red pepper because... Why not? Uh, it's a meatball, so oregano. And it's a meatball, Parmesan cheese. The green can. All right, so this is where it gets weird. <laughs> Spaghetti. So I 
we cook the spaghetti, then I cut it down into more manageable pieces because it's going in a meatball. So I figure roughly like uh, a third. Sounds like a plan. We're, we doing, don't know. we're, we're gonna find out. Let's see what it looks like when we get there. Now comes the fun part, if it works. If if is a very good description of things. So we make it into a little ball. Well, yeah, there you go. Stick a hole in it because we're gonna no, no. stuff okay. it with cheese. I think two. Two? I think two. So we got some fresh mozzarella pearls. Tiny mozzarella balls. And that is it. So this is our, you're gonna do two yeah. just to. This is a tester, man. Just to make you, all right. Cause I don't know if it's gonna disintegrate cause we didn't use a binder. We didn't use a binder. I was gonna ask, are you gonna bread it? Not yet. Well, this is this is our first go. We're, we're gonna try it just like this. I guess Julie, you're spinning. Okay. Thank you, Jason. Did it sling on you? Nice. Let's, we'll be right back and see how this works out. So here we are with our test subject. Test subject. Deep fried spaghetti meatball. Deep fried spaghetti meatball stuffed with mozzarella. And we did put some... The, the reducer made spaghetti sauce yesterday. I think it was yesterday. The day before, we reheated it. Took a shortcut. Anyway, so <laughs> we have... Basically a meat sauce on our meatball. Yes, because it's steam packet. Yeah, why not, right? Uh, so Let's cut it in half and see what that middle looks like. Hopefully it's done. I don't know if you can hear him. He said hopefully it's done in the middle, which it is not. Not quite there. All right, that's subject number two coming your way. <laughs> <laughs> we'll be right back. Uh, welcome back to the spaghetti meatball. Stuff from mozzarella cheese. Compilation video. <laughs> uh, <laughs> so we're gonna try this one more time. One more again. One more again. <laughs> we didn't time the first one, so we don't know where we're gonna be at here. That's way better. Way better. I think six minutes. Right. Six minutes. We did five on this, but I do see a little bit of pink, but not. I can live with that. A little bit of pink's fine, yeah. You got your own foot. Get out. Oh, you're gonna cut it? Yeah, dude, that's a big ass bite. Yeah. You were the one that was like, that's half the, that's why it's funny. It is funny. Well, I'm, all right, it's about to be real funny when I'm. <laughs> that is so greasy. Greasy? Crunchy noodle, like she was saying. Crunchy noodle comes through. The outside of the meatballs kind of got a little crunch to it. The parmesan came through really mm -hmm. strong. The, but it has soft noodles on the inside. I feel like... I think it needs salt. <laughs> more salt. I can go with that, yeah. Um, mozzarella didn't really come through that much. No. It was almost like it didn't need to be there. Yeah. More cheese. More Parmesan and less mozzarella, maybe? I just, more mozzarella. Okay. All right, so here's what you do. 
You take your noodles, you put it in your beef fry. Oregano, you make, you cheese. Make salmon cat food. Yeah. And roll it up and deep fry it for like six minutes. Then throw some marinara on it. And you got <laughs> a party favorite from Team Vacuum. <laughs> Alright. I think that's it for this one. Yeah, we'll do that later. Yeah, we'll get back to that haggis thing. <laughs> that's it for this week. Alright guys, once again, thank you for watching. Remember to subscribe, like, click the bell icon, share, do all, all that those fun things. stuff. Have a good night. See you next week. Is that what it is, really? Why is everything I say sounds so dirty? Like <laughs>